Introduction This video provides short explanation about feedback magnetic levitation control experiment. Before go to the introduction you must refer your lab sheet. Magnetic levitation technology has received tremendous innovation in various engineering fields and it is being utilized in various automation applications. The concept behind all applications is to provide contactless levitation to reduce the effect of wear and tear. Therefore, increasing the efficiency and reliability. The maglev trains and magnetic bearings are the most popular examples for the magnetic levitation systems. On the other word, the levitation is a way of lifting and suspending an object in the air without physical support and contact with the ground or other objects. To overcome the gravitational force of attraction, it is necessary to create a counteracting force that is large enough to lift the object. The maglev experiment is a magnetic ball suspension system which is used to levitate a steel ball in air by the electromagnetic force generated by an electromagnet. The magnetic levitation system is non-linear and unstable. There are various control strategies available for their stable operation. The maglev system mainly consists of four major parts, suspended steel ball, infrared sensor for distance measurement, controller and actuator including electromagnet and power amplifier. The steel ball is mainly controlled through current tie. The magnetic force acting on the steel ball depends on two parameters. First, the current I flowing in the coil. And the second one is the distance between coil and the steel ball. When consider the electrical system, it is allowed to transfer the measured signals to the PC via an I.O. card. The maglev is a SISO plant. That means single input single output system. Position X is the model output and the voltage U is the control signal. 